students, students, I have terrible news that I need to tell you right away. I cannot wait another single sec. Wait a minute, is this thing recording? Hello, am I muted? No, no, okay, okay. Am I talking loud enough? Maybe if I get closer. There, that's better. As I was saying, I have some truly devastating information. Our musical has been canceled. I was so looking forward to our dress rehearsal tonight, but I'm truly sorry to report that our production, Brushes with Greatness, the Dental Hygiene Musical, will never get to see the light of day. The world will never get to witness your interpretation of this great American classic. <laughs> I know how they always say the show must go on, but in this case, it can't. That's... I should go. Goodbye for now. Uh, how do now, how do I hang this thing up? Siri and video. Okay, that's great. Uh, hello, Principal Boltman. Yes, I didn't know the show is canceled. What? No, the drama department can't shut down permanently. I know the musical is supposed to raise money for next year, but... No, don't go. We can't get rid of the entire drama program. <sighs> Goodbye. Oh, this video didn't send yet? Maybe if I click this button here that says send, it will- Calling all cast and crew. Did you see that video? Wow, Miss Marzana does not know how to use technology. But more importantly, we can't lose the drama department. We have to do something no matter what obstacles we face. Life mirrors art, and this is just like our musical, like Bob Flossie says at the beginning of Brushes with Greatness. We don't give up. We don't give in. We journey on. We rise again. And all that we face, our greatest foe, we don't give up. Yes, this I know. We'll tell that crack and ginger virus to just stay away. We'll brush and floss together, we can keep back the decay. Well, maybe it's not like the last part, but you know what I mean. Let me know what you think. Hello, fellow thespians. I'm speaking to you all from the inside of my closet, where I retreated as soon as I heard the terrible news. I've decided to move in here and hide away from the world. After all, if there's no musical theater, what's the point of going outside? I will live out the rest of my days nestled amongst my old costumes, my tap shoes, and my signed poster from last year's production of Susical the Musical. I was a pretty great Yertle the Turtle, wasn't I? <sighs> Don't cry for me, former castmates. I'll be fine. I'll be here, tweeting at Lynn, Manuel, Miranda, and humming the score to Pippin for the rest of eternity. Good luck with the rest of your lives. So long. Farewell. Off Wiedersen. Goodbye. End scene. Look, we can't just crawl back into our closets. We have to bring brushes with greatness to life and save the drama program. I have an idea. You know how we're all sending each other videos right now? What if we did the show online just like this? I mean, if you can order a Ben Platt to use tissue online, you can totally do a show on... Not that anyone would order or use tissue online. Who would spend $40 on something like that? I know I wouldn't. Yuck. All I'm saying is that you can do a lot on the internet. We could film ourselves, then piece the scenes together, and make a full musical. We could... <laughs> Oh dear, Evan Hansen, what have I done? Yes, that's a genius idea. Not the $40 tissue. That's ridiculous. But a virtual musical is a great idea. We'll perform Brushes with Greatness, the dental hy hygiene musical, at home and stream it online. Check it out. I can do the opening number from my living room. Pit that had some teeth. There's been a silent battle just beneath. Who fights that battle? We've known them since you. Our heroes, Bob Fosse and Tommy Tooth. Come listen to their brush, 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 brushes with greatness. A musical inside their jaws. Brush, 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 brushes with greatness. Just sit back. Amazing, right? 
only problem is, Mrs. Marzano, I don't think she's going to like this idea very much. She's pretty scared of technology. How do we get her to agree? Um, I may have an idea for how we could get Miss Marzano to agree. I wrote a little something. I'm not sure if it's any good, but maybe it could help. I don't usually perform my songs, but we have to save the drama club. So here goes nothing. School is closed, the theater too. What are the actors supposed to do? How do we go on with the show? We've rehearsed, we've sung along. We know the words to every song. We're prepared, but where do we go? We go online, set the lights, fill the screen. The show must go on, the show must go online, piece by piece, scene by scene. The show must go on, the show must go online, so it does stop that webcam. Yeah, make it shine. The show must go on, online. So, what do you think? That was beautiful. I must say, I am moved. Deeply moved. At first, I was hesitant, but after hearing that song, I say we go for it. The show must go online. Now, please reach out to me if you have any questions about the performances or about the technology. I have a Hotmail account and an AOL account. I am very connected. You have all inspired me and given me hope. Now, let the dress rehearsal begin. Okay, Siri, and video. Wait, I mean Siri, send. That should do it. I wonder how they found out about the drama department, Mr. Whiskers. Uh, do you have any idea? I don't either. Did you know I performed in Cats once, Mr. Whiskers? I was tremendous. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, look, Mr. Whiskers, the video didn't send. So you're a you troublemaker. Okay, I got this. So Miss Mazzano sings to cats. Good to know. Anyways, I was thinking, since we're at home, we could get creative. Like, we could do some of the actual toothbrushing songs in an actual bathroom. These are an actual toothbrush and toothpaste. Check it out. This would be great. At the big plaque battle, at the end of the show, one plaque is all like. This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flashing, blushing sound. And then I hear what's coming to say the day, like? No whoops will die, define cavities. Kiss black goodbye, define cavities. This tooth can't be pulled out. Good, right? Wow, that was some great toothbrushing. Amazing form. Although, it was kind of hard to understand the lyrics, but we'll work on that later. I have been working on Plaque Song in the Great Gum Canyon all day, and I think I have found the perfect way to perform it at home. I had some interruptions before, but we're all fine now. This is scene three, take six. I like it Q U I E T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How I love the lovely hush. Away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa la la, tra la la, shoo ba do ba dee dee. Shh, quiet time for me. Ya da 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 da. Ya da 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 da. Oh, fa 
la la, tra la la, shoobity doobity dee, knock it off! <laughs> Quiet time for me! Hey, hey, hey! I guess what? I have a dog. This is Lucy. She can sit and stay and um eat. She eats a lot, actually. He also sleeps a lot. I'd say she's a stellar sleeper. Also, pretty great at sniffing and licking things. <laughs> and just great at being the boss. I know it doesn't have to do with the musical. I just wanted to show you how cute she is. I mean, have you ever seen anything cuter than the frog? So, back to the musical. It's your trusty costume designer here. Now remember, even though our costumes are at school, we can still get creative at home. After all, this is our dress rehearsal. As we discussed last week, our base costume will be all black. No logos, no designs. And yes, that includes your Olaf t-shirt, Toby. Let it go. Now, I have some suggestions for everyone. Listen up. For Tommy Tooth and the other toothbrushes, you should you should have some hairbrushes and tape them onto your hand like this. See? It's really easy. Now for the second brush. Well, I suppose if you already have one brush on there, it does make it a little harder to get the second brush on. Uh, just, just hold the brush. I guess you just hold the brush. Just hold the brush in your hand like so. Then, like your toothbrush with bristles. Then you can sing and dance easily. Though, I suppose if you have to pick something up... Ugh, oh, never mind. Just get creative, people. Don't let me down. Thanks for the costume tips. This next song is the most emotional center of the entire story. I've been practic practicing my expressions in the mirror all day, and I think I may have achieved an Audrey McDonald level performance. Now I just have to capture it on film, but that's easy enough. Here I go. When you look in my face, you will understand I need you. When you look in my heart, you will understand I care. When you take a deep look, into my eyes you'll see a soul that never lies my face my heart my smile my teeth my eyes wow that was um um well your voice sounded great but the camera work was a little bit off i have something that might make things easier what if tommy tooth was played by an actual toothbrush that way you can see their full body while they're singing Brilliant, right? You look at my face, you can clearly see me and you need you. Amazing, right? When you look at my heart, you will understand I care. What a performance. If you take a deep look at your suit. Ah! Bad toothbrush. My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Okay, so maybe it's not the best idea. Hello, Premier Lightning Designer. I thought I'd demonstrate some ways for you to do lighting designing at home. You can turn the lights on or turn them off. Blackout. If you have a dimmer, you can dim them. 
Mm-hmm, what else? Well, you could have some on and some off. And you could use the lamp too. And that's about it. Good luck, I guess. Spotlight on me. As you all know, this next song contains the most important information in the entire musical, which is what I am demonstrating for you. It is the big reveal, and the stakes are extremely high. If the audience misses this, the whole show will fall apart. We mustn't let that happen. So we need to be extremely clear, like so. As we ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet, I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who makes the evil forces wins. And his name is... Line? What's the line? Well, I guess we'll never know his name, will we? <laughs> this is your stage manager here. We are moments away from showtime. Now, I want everyone to stay calm, okay? We're going to be fine, fine, I'm fine. Are you fine? I'm sure you are because calm is contagious and I'm totally calm. But you're all doing, you're all doing really good stuff. But I do have a few tiny little notes before we begin, before we go live, okay? Okay. Find a quiet spot to record. Remember your lines, especially the important ones. Don't sing with a toothbrush in your mouth. I'm begging you. Make sure the camera is pointed at your face when you're singing about your face. And for goodness sake, don't buy a $40 used tissue online. It's not about the show, but just don't do it, okay? Okay, we're about to go live. Remember, this is just for family and friends, so there's no pressure, just have fun and... Uh-oh. Ha... How is, how is this possible? Is this real? Oh, it's real. Okay. Okay. Uh, some news. It looks like Kristen Bell heard about our show somehow, and she tweeted out the link to our live performance, and she's hosting a virtual viewing party, and over 50,000 people have RSVP'd, but that's totally fine, right? Right? Okay. Places. It's showtime. Uh. Hello to all our viewers, and welcome to our virtual theater. My students are telling me this is being broadcast live over the interwebs. Thank you all for joining us. Anyways, I want to remind you all to unwrap your candy and turn off your devices now. Oh, that's my stage manager. She's telling me that you're watching this on your devices. So keep them on, I guess. That's neat. Anywho, some of you have been with us since, our, since the very beginning from our first production of In the Tights, a Shakespearean hip-hop opera. And some of you are experiencing our program for the very first time today. I want to thank you all for your support. This program means so much to us, and we would hate the thought of losing it forever. <sighs> okay, never mind with all that. Now, without further ado, I would give you Brushes with Greatness, the dental hygiene musical. Turn up! Ever since the mouth appeared, I've had some tea. There's been a silent battle just beneath. And who fights this battle? Well, you've known them since you. Our heroes, Bob Flossie and Tommy, too. Uh-oh, here comes the plaque. I mean, ever with the narrow and the gun. Do the buttons is my very best of jokes. And between the two of us, we will attack. So if you're lacking dental hygiene, then watch your own back. Come listen to your brush, 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 brush it with greatness. A musical inside your top. Wisdom teeth and holy molars in the cast. Yeah, brace yourself for ten excitement, hold it fast. Welcome to our show. Brushes with greatness. Tommy Tooth, the legendary toothbrush? 
Is that you? Who's asking? It's me, Bob Fossey. I haven't seen you since the deep cleaning of 92, since you banished Helitosis. She was awful. You were legendary. That was a long time ago, Flossy. I don't clean mouths anymore. I'm retired. But we got a black situation and no one cleans like you. Black's too big for me now, kid. There's no hope. I give up. No, I refuse to accept that. We don't give up, we don't give in, we journey on, we rise again. All that we face, our greatest foe, we don't give up, yes this I know. We'll tell that black engine divide us just to stay away. With brush and floss together, we will keep back the decay. So what do you say? All right, Flossy, I'm in. Hey, it's me, Plaque, and I think I found the perfect place to live. This mouth is amazing. Look at all the tartar and buildup in this glorious gum canyon. Shh, did you hear that? No? That's because it is a sound of perfect silence and serenity. There's not a toothbrush or floss in sight, and I am sure that they are not nearby eavesdropping on me. This is amazing. I like it, Q-U-I-E-T. Yes, quiet is the best for me. How oh, I love the lovely hush. Away from a buzzing brush. Oh, fa la la, tra la la, shoo we doo but it dee It's shh, quiet time for me. This is the best! I'm so glad that I banished Tommy Tooth and Bob Flossie and the worst one of all, he who must not be named. I like the food quite sugary. Yes, candy fills my heart with glee. Nothing like a sweet old snack. Gives boost to good old black. That's me. Forget to floss, I'm the boss. Cavity, cavity, we it's shh. Quiet time for me. My name is P L A Q E. I mean U E. Been working on a cavity. My favorite word of all is neglect. I strike when you least expect. Say yay decay every day. Thank you for setting me free. It's shh, quiet time for shh, quiet time for shh. Quiet time for me. I cannot deny it. I love it so quiet. The silence is what I enjoy. Hey, Tommy Tooth. Did you hear what Plaque just said as we were totally eavesdropping? Sure did, kid. It sounds like he's our only hope at defeating Plaque. Do you know him? Do I? As we ready for this battle, our biggest battle yet, I'm reminded of a hero who I never could forget. The one who makes the evil forces wince. And his name is Harold Rince. Harold Rince? He is caring, he is daring, he's everybody's friend. And his name will live forever, I never will forget. I met him and I've liked him ever since. And his name is Harold. Rinse away bacteria, that's what he does best. Harold will take care of us so brave. If mouths were royal, he would be the prince. Harold Rinse, Harold Rinse, Harold Rinse. Harold. My old friend, it's me, Tommy Tooth. I knew I'd find you here in Canine Cavern. 
Wait, before you scamper off, just hear me out. I'm sorry about the great peanut butter on the roof of the mouth mishap of 87. I know I blamed you, but I was the one to blame. Now we have a serious plaque problem and we need your help. Partner, please, I'm begging you. Harold, I know we've been down this road before. And you'd said you'd never work with me again Yes, I know I've made mistakes It's a tooth, I've caused some aches But know that you will always be my friend When you look at my face You can clearly see I need you When you look at my heart You will understand I Harold, I do care. If you take a deep walk into my eyes, you see the soul that never lies. My face, my heart, my smile, my teeth, my eyes. Harold, I love you too. Now let's go pulverize some plaque. Plaque, why couldn't you just stay away for once? Harold Rince, Tommy Tooth, Bob Flossie, the dental trifecta. You betcha, and we want you out of this mouth. Forget it, this is my turf now, and I think this tooth is ready for extraction, don't you? No, not the molar! This mouth is my domain now. I don't want you around. I'm sick of dealing with your flossing, brushing sound. Leave that tooth alone. Never. Then it's time for battle. Come on, team. No roots will die, defying cavities. Kiss plaque goodbye, defying cavities. The tooth can't be pulled out. I won't go easily, and neither will my friend, Gingivitis. Oh no, there's two of them. That's right, and we're gonna wreck this tooth. Wait, please, you have to see reason. Beautiful. This mouth could be so beautiful. We know every molar and incisor could be clean. Boo, attack, get him! We're fighting back, defying cavities. So take that plaque, defying cavities. The tooth won't be pulled out. No, we did it. Yeah, rinse and spit, pull out the gauze. There's greatness found between the jaws. Together we have saved this mouth. Say, oh. Truly remarkable. That was the greatest defying cavities I've seen since Adele Dazine made her off, off, off Broadway debut. Thank you. I want to thank you all for tuning in. It means the world to us, and we would hate... Oh, goodness. I'm terribly sorry. No phones in the theater. I should go. Thank you. Thank you all. Hello, Principal Waltman. You watched... Oh, they did? Oh, that's, they do? That's wonderful news. Oh, thank you. Thank you for saving the drama club. Of course, we'll be back next year with Greasy, the Karma Can musical. All right, thanks again. Talk to you later. Oh, this is still recording? What is up with this technology? It's almost as if I left it on, on purpose. Well, since I have you here, kids, if you're watching, thank you. You were wonderful. Even though you weren't together, you worked as an ensemble and created something truly spectacular. I'm so proud to be your drama teacher, and I'm so glad the show went online. School is closed, the theater too. What are the actors supposed to do? How do we go on with the show? We've rehearsed, we've sung along, we know the words.
to every song We're prepared, but where do we go? We go online, set the lights, build a screen The show must go on, the show must go online Piece by piece, singing by sheen the show must go on, the show must go online. For the stuff that we do, they're making sure. The show must go on. Even though we're far apart, we can still connect through art. Take a breath and get in the zone. Show we can't contain our deep desire to entertain. We can do this all Set the lights, build the screens, the show must go on, the show must go online. Piece by piece, scene by scene, the show must go on, the show must go online. A virtual outlet for the theatrical impact, the show must go on.